I'll take care of this one. Stay back. I won't let you take us down. Dang. Tough one, aren't you? Darn it! Take this! Alright. Now you're going down! The Fell Dragon has returned to the Earth. You... you saved me, didn't you? Well, thanks. That was close. But that wasn't magic, was it? Him magic, perhaps? Surely not. Are you a coder? Ah. Uh. Hey, 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 whoa, whoa. I... I'm sorry. You really took a beating. What's a girl doing out here? Girl? Are you talking about me? Well, yeah, I, I don't know your name. Uh, sorry, I wasn't trying to be rude. I'm Lark, and you are... Rude? What is rude? Uh, what? I thought you were going to call me girl. Do you call everyone girl? What? What are you talking about? I'm a diva, but you can call me Rifia. <laughs> huh? Well, what kind of a weirdo are you? A weirdo? A derogatory term for a strange person. Huh? What is wrong with you? Oh dear, are you angry? No, but I'm getting annoyed. Well, whatever. Okay, Riffia, right? Let's just get you somewhere safe for now. There might be more fell dragons around here. Somewhere safe? Yeah, I think the village of Tapazion is southeast of here. I'll take you as far as there. It's the least I can do. Really? Okay. 
Thank you. Boy, what's going on here anyway? Before we go into battle, I have to explain something. You'll need to use a different strategy when fighting together in a group. What do you mean? Well, you know we can only perform as many actions as we have AP for, right? Of course. Every action we take expends AP, right? Right. When a party fights together, everyone shares the same pool of AP. You can't just think about your own AP when you take an action. But that allows us to determine exactly who takes action and how many actions they perform. You mean I can just stand back and watch? You could, but in most cases it's probably best to perform some kind of action. A group that works together and divides up the actions equally is tough to beat. Anyway, we don't have time for any more chit-chat. Let's go. Piece of cake. You're hurt. Let me heal you with magic. Yes, please. You can select an action by pressing the character toggle button. You can see who's going to act next by looking at this. So I just need to select an action with the character toggle button, right? Yep. Be careful, though. Every time you use magic, you will expend some MP. Oh, and don't forget to confirm everyone's actions by pressing the action button. Okay. Piece of cake. I'm ready to go. Healing water. Cool, thanks. Piece of cake. See ya. Hmm. See ya. As easy as it gets. I have to try harder. Piece of cake. Yeah. Uh. Hmm. Yeah. See ya. Piece of cake. See ya. We're all in good shape, yeah? Head 
Heads up, folks. Ready for battle. That's it. I'll Ready do my for best battle. Too. Yeah. Healing water. Cool. Thanks. <laughs> Ready for battle. Yeah. Out of my way. Ready for battle. See ya! We're all in good shape, yeah? I have to try harder. Strange. It's sunny, but it's raining. Uh, the devil must be beating his wife. Who? Beating his what? You don't know that expression? No. But I like it. It sounds interesting. Hey, watch your step. Uh... Thank you. Don't mention it. Just be careful, okay? Well, we're here. Is this Topazion? Yeah, we're at the far north end of the Empire. The Empire? Do you mean the Meridian Empire? Sure, what else would I mean? The Meridian Empire is the only thing around here. Oh, really? So... So I finally reached the Empire. Huh? You're not from the Empire. I'm from Bennett Nash. Bennett Nash? What? That's in the Turamillion Republic. What are you doing here anyway? You do realize that Turamillia and the Empire are enemies. It was my... My mother's dying... Dying... W wish. Hey, what's wrong, Rufia? I feel a little dizzy. You're probably just worn out. Let's get you to an inn. Inn? What's an inn? What do you mean, what's an inn? An inn's an inn, a place to sleep. Are there beds at an inn? Of course there are. Oh, how wonderful. I've been sleeping on the ground for days. Whoa, definitely inn time then. Are you okay? Can you walk? Yes. Lark, I'm so glad. I knew you were alive. Alf? What? What are you doing here? Lightship Fleet 2 returned from duty. So I thought I'd come and find you. Ah, uh, you can explain later. Riffia needs a place to rest. Riffia? Oh. Uh, hello. Uh, hello. Hmm. 
So that's what happened after you fell from the light ship with that fell dragon. Yeah, this has become a complete mess. What am I supposed to do about her? Don't talk like that. Imagine how hard it must have been for her to come here from Termilia. If there's some way we can help her, then I think we should. Hmm. You're just as nice as always. In fact, you're too nice for your own good, you know that? I mean, what's the prince of an empire doing looking for one missing legionnaire? You don't expect me to just sit around while my friend is in peril, do you? Well, we slew the fell dragon, right? I'm not going to be treated as a deserter, am I? That would mean the remaining half of my contract money would be... Always about the money with you, eh? Don't worry. You'll be paid just as stated in the contract. Phew. Well, good. I put my life on the line back there. I'll be right back. I need to report that you've been found. Would you mind preparing for the journey before she wakes up? The journey? You're going to take Riffia over to where she's going, right? I'm going with you. Is a prince allowed to traipse around without his bodyguards? You'll be my bodyguard, won't you? Ah, yes, of course, your highness. One more thing. I'd really appreciate it if you'd check around the village for any fell dragon damage. The village elder should be able to offer you some information. Oh, right. We can't be forgetting the plight of your subjects, huh? Do I detect some sarcasm? I trust you'll have no problems doing what I've asked. Sorry for leaving you alone. Get some rest. You need it. I'm Lark Bright Lagoon, Legionnaire of the Meridian Imperial Army. I'm just on my way back from hunting fell dragons up north. Have they been causing you any trouble? You're from the army? Well, you must be exhausted. Luckily, our village has magic to repel the fell dragons. You can relax safely here. That's good to hear. Has anything out of the ordinary been happening? Come to think of it, I've heard rumors of a wrecked Termillion ship on the East Coast. A Republic ship? I'll report that once I get to Royal City. By the way, is there a doctor in this village? Yes, there is. Can you send him to the inn for me? One of my companions may be sick. Yes, of course. Can we really leave you by yourself, my prince? I'm sorry to be so selfish with you. My brother Vice will probably be upset. Very well. Best of luck, sir. You're a very selfish prince. Apparently, I chose the wrong friends. Well, if your highness says so, it must be true. Ah, are you the doctor the village elder sent? Indeed I am. And you are? Thanks for coming. Follow me. There's nothing wrong with her. She's just very tired. That's good. However, there's a dragon gem stuck to her skin, and I can't remove it. Strange, this. Dragon gem? You mean the gems found on fell dragons? Doesn't everyone have one? That might be normal in your country, but it's definitely not normal here. Really? How weird! So says the weirdo. Lark, you shouldn't talk like that. Thank you very much, Doctor. Here's your fee. Take care. Do you have enough money to pay? Yes, I brought at least enough money to get us back to Royal City. You can have the remainder. Those Tremillions sure have some strange customs. Why would you attach dragon gems to your body? 
I don't think I've actually heard of that custom before. Oh well, at least you didn't have some mystery illness. So, what's your plan now? To follow my mother's dying wish to go to Jada in the Meridian Empire. Jada? Do you know someone there? No, I just need to go there. Jada is home to one of the Empire's critical energy sources. No way am I taking someone from the Republic there. Oh, don't worry about me. I'll go there by myself. It's not about your safety, Rifia. It'll be fine, Lark. Just as long as she doesn't go near the ray supply in Dragon Prison. Besides, Jada is on the way back to Royal City. Let's just take her with us. You really are too nice. Have I mentioned that lately? Well, that's all fine and dandy. Is that okay with you, Rifia? Will you really take me to Jada? Huh, I'm sure Mr. Nice Guy, Sir Alf, will. Oh, but you're nice too, Lark. Huh. <sighs> <laughs> You've seen right through him, Riffia. He may put on a tough guy act, but he's really a gentleman at heart. Shut up. Let's just get her to Jada for now. Thank you both so much. Piece of cake. I'm ready Let's to go. Let's do this. Got your back. Yeah. Well done. Piece of cake. See ya. You messed with the wrong bunch.
Let's take a break here. But we just got started. We have a lady with us. We have to be aware of her needs, you see. Thank you, Alf, but I'm fine. Huh, I guess she's still recovering from her last journey. Oh, uh, I forgot to mention it, but a Turamillion shipwreck was sighted on the eastern coast. Interesting. I should probably have that investigated. Uh, that might be my ship. Your ship? What do you mean? My home was attacked by strange people. A servant helped me escape and I was able to reach the Empire by ship. But then we were attacked by fell dragons as we approached the coast. Did the fell dragons get to the others? Yes, there were just too many. And after that was when you met me in the forest. What's with this talk of servants and your home under attack? Just who are you? I'm a diva. <sighs> yeah, you said that earlier, but what is a diva? You don't know, Lark? A diva is a priestess of the Republic's North Noirism. A North Noir priestess? That makes you someone special. No wonder you keep spouting all that weirdo stuff. Lark, how many times do I have to tell you, don't talk like that? 